Okay, I've deposited everything that I want in there, including money, because you don't need to carry money with you. And in fact, if you die with money on you, you lose a lot of it. So I suggest putting everything you have in the stash before you leave town. Now, yes. Kara, she can reset your stat and skill points. I mean, well, she can do it three times, but she can do. Uh, she can do it at any time, so if you ever feel like you mess up, uh, feel free to talk to her, but, you know, don't don't mess up too much. Uh, what does she have? She has the Tome of Town Portal. I will take it. And I'm going to put this in there. This can hold 20 sc scrolls of Town Portal. And trust me, you'll encounter a lot of them, and I might fill that thing up real quick. Because there are better ways to move around the countryside. But we haven't gotten there. Uh, anything here? No. No. None of the none of the scepters are good for me. Here's a long staff uh, for sorceresses. Uh, the wands, I believe, are... Yeah, wands are necromancers. And then the short staffs are sorceresses again. Now, you might be wondering, what happened to all those potions that you picked up? Because I equipped the sash, right? Because I got a sash. It gives me a second line here on my uh, healing potions uh, so that well on my potion bar I should say I just have healing potions there and every time that I get a better better quality belt it'll add another row I believe up to four total rows which is insane now that we are done here though in the bloodmore just make a beeline for where Flavy was because she will no longer tell us that we are under leveled because we are no longer under leveled we're apparently level four I don't you know I don't know what was wrong with these people why they couldn't handle the uh, the menace of, of all these things outside right now but you know the, you would think these rogues would be able to handle it what's Beware. up Flavy? Beyond lies mortal danger for the likes of you. Not mortal danger, but I'll give you danger. But it's not going to kill me. We are in the cold plains. And here we have found the waypoint. I don't know if you guys spotted that waypoint in town, but you step on it, these, these little blue flames kick up, and you can travel instantly back to the rogue encampment, which is awesome. Fast travel. Even Diablo 2 had it. Let's... Oh, got take on a dark spear woman. Now we're going to be fighting larger groups of these fallen. They're going to have shamans with them. They're going to have multiple shamans with them. So you're going to want to just try to focus on those right now. I don't believe that the shamans can resurrect other shamans. So once you get them once, they sh you should be good. Really? You guys just ran? Jeez. Picking up. Lots of potions here, though. That's always good. And now we can keep... Really? He hit me and died. Because of because of my belt? Ooh, boots. I will take those. If only we had a way to identify things more readily. I'm not going to pick up uh, the tome of, uh, of identify. We're just going to go with the tome of town portal. Um... But, to be honest, I, I would say I don't know why they put it in there, but they do put it in there. Um, but it becomes useless a after a certain point. A certain point very early on. Oh, we finally got a key! So now if I wanted to, I could go back and get what's in that treasure chest. But to be honest, I don't care all that much right now. These buildings, I hate them. Usually the shamans are hanging out in them. Luckily this time he was not. There's another shaman? Ah, down here. Yeah, they've got a range, man. They've got a range. Apparently I've lured another pack of shaman or sorry, of, of fallings this way. I hate these buildings because it's hard to say when you're in the fire. Because apparently I was right there. Let's take this guy out. Take out these other guys over here. Come on, get back here. Oh, there's a shaman somewhere. He's got, he got resurrected from somewhere. Where? There's so many dead things over here, huh? Oh, wait. Look at that range on that guy. That's ridiculous. And this is how you end up exploring the map before you really want to in this game. He's trying to find shamans and killing them. Luckily, 
Like I said, this is in uh, normal difficulty. You, you won't have to chase things down in the higher difficulties. In fact, you won't even have to, f to, to chase things down pretty much at the end of this act. It, it starts getting, you know, the AI starts getting a little bit easier to, to handle. And by easier to handle, I mean more likely to kill you. They become a little bit more predictable. They don't go, oh, are you here? I mean, seriously. They, they, they had every opportunity to swing at me, and they didn't. Well, they tried. And they failed. They missed. Okay, uh... Oh, there is a shaman there. I did not see him. Damn, fireballs. I hate mages. Superior javelin. Now, those are throwing weapons, once again. As you might expect from javelins. But... Uh, I don't really, really recommend you ever using them, but because they were superior, I might as well pick them up, bring them back to town with me, and sell them. Oh, looks like there is a cave here. Let's open up this chest, damage buckler. We'll go to the skill shrine. Anything back here? Oh, this looks like it go goes on for a way. ways. Let's go down here. What do we got? The cave. This is not like a, a quest place or anything like that, so let's just go in. This is just an optional dungeon. But optional dungeons are sometimes where you find the best loot. Oh, skeletons! It was only a matter of time before we found skeletons. There we go. So we're starting to pick up more keys. Keys are very common. Oh, damn archers. Okay. No, seriously, damn archers. Now, yeah, healing potions, they heal you slowly over time, and they'll show you the max right there. How much you can get, or how much you are going to get out of your potion before it expires. And automatically, the one uh, higher up on the belt drops down. Uh, is he? Okay, this, this special looks like it's draining my mana, because I don't have anything to use right now, really. And I've already used so many things on my belt. There we go. Mana burn. Bane Dancer the Mala with mana burn. Damn it. Die. So the good thing about having the slow potion regen is that if you get hit, right, it just decreases the max and your and your normal, and it'll just keep going. So technically, it'll he it can heal more than your total life bar, which is awesome. And you get all those healing potions back. Always good. It's always worth coming down here. It's, j if, if only for specials. If only for the specials. Because they have great drops. 100% of the time. There's no chance of them ever not dropping something. Um, yeah, I th this looks like a, a pretty small cave. I do know that these typically have two floors. Like I said, it's randomly generated every time you boot up the game. You, in single player, pretty much it's randomly generated. I, I don't know when, but it, it's randomly generated once. But in, in multiplayer, every time you boot up a server. And it can get quite annoying if... Um, let's say you've already cleared out uh, one of those waypoints. And then, uh, then you try to travel to it after loading up a new game, and all of a sudden you have to clear out the room again. Oh, like this room here. Alright, let's take on the skeletons. Because they cannot be resurrected by the, by the shaman, I don't think. Alright. Die. Alright, not doing too bad. Not doing too bad at all. The game's not too difficult, so I'm not surprised. But still, we're doing pretty good. Cleaning up house pretty quickly here. I like just uh, running around holding the alt button. That's just me. Uh. Damn it. Clear away! Let me kill you. Usually, I, I, I do miss treasure from time to time because you have to kill all this shit. <laughs> and I miss it, uh, but that's why I hold down the alt button so that they can go, Hey, you missed something. You do have to destroy barrels, things of that sort. Uh, there, but since you're in the plains, there's not very many um, not very many barrels in the plains. So we haven't come across them, and we won't really uh, for, for some time. 
until we start getting into the other stuff. And once again, a level up. Level ups do heal you in this game. Always appreciate it. Damage quilted armor. That's like the worst armor you can get in the game. At least for your torso. I don't know what to call it. <laughs> How to distinguish that kind of armor from, uh, from, let's say, like, boots or something. You could technically say boots or armor, too. But, you know what I mean? Oh, man. Just a whole bunch of stuff. Crude boots. Do not care. Get over here and die. Damn, this place uh, got a little bit bigger than I anticipated. Gem Shrine! Oh, hey, always go those. Get yourself a gem. We'll go over how awesome those are later. When I get a chance to talk about it. What I'm actually looking for, because I do have the expansion, right? And you want, if you're going to have the expansion, you're going to want to to start the game with it loaded, with an expansion character. Um, because they tend to drop, uh, alongside gems, you can get runes. And I also believe that the, uh, the stash is bigger when you have the expansion installed. So I highly recommend getting the expansion if you're going for... Too. Plus it adds a, another act, as you might expect from an expansion. Uh, the act at the end, it's it's actually pretty good. Um, I don't know, I don't remember how much the expansion cost. Uh, I did buy this as a as a set. Um, it was about the same price as getting Diablo 2 by itself, so I was just like whatever. It came with a strategy guide too. <laughs> like I care about strategy guides on paper. Ah. Uh, uh, you'll never believe what the strategy guide said for, for paladins. Ah, damn it. Damn hungry dead. Stopping me from killing the shaman. Sometimes it, it's worth it uh, in the higher difficulties to kill some of the fallen uh, so that the, the shaman spends its time resurrecting them instead of attacking you when you charge it. But, yeah, right here, it, yeah, it doesn't matter. The strategy guide said for paladins that Blessed Hammer was pretty much useless. Now, for those of you that aren't familiar with the game, we'll go over uh, we'll go over what Blessed Hammer is eventually because that's what I'm gonna go for. And for those of you that are familiar with the game, will know how much they just everybody was a hammered in. Oh my God! Yeah, three there. Give me more health, and then uh, no need to look at the, s the skills right now. I'm not going to be using any of them. Oh, shit. Okay. A ton of archers. A demon with teleportation. All of these are classed as demons for the most part. Alright, we're going to need to do a bit of healing here because out of all the enemies, archers are the most intelligent. And I hate them. I don't know where where that teleporter went to. I, I didn't catch the name. <laughs> Die! Uh, I need I need a better chance to hit here. There we go. Die! 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 Everything seems to be dying in one shot. Makes things a lot easier. Where did that? Teleporting bitch, go. I don't see her anywhere. Is there a dead body I missed? Uh, no. Those were the the, the bodies of my slain. Oh, there's another. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, that was cold. Cold is a bitch in this game. It ridiculously slows you down. Like. Uh, to the point that I'm running. I'm I'm just running and I'm actually going to open up a, a town portal. Yeah. <laughs> Be right back. Okay, got a new uh, new set of uh, potions. Fucking cold. I hate cold. It is by far the worst thing in this game. Fuck. Fuck, fuck, fuck. There are a shit ton of you. Fucking cold crow, man. Fucking cold crow. 
There's so many damn archers. Alright, I'm gonna have to try to lure some of them. I have no choice here but to lure. Just like I did in Diablo 1. Fuck, she hit me! Uh, yeah, the first hit. First hit. Can they hit me from... Yeah, they can hit me around that. Oh, here's the teleporting bitch. <laughs> Where'd you get to, Doom Grella? I lured one. All I got was one. Oh, fuck, she hit me again. Alright, I got one. This game is not supposed to be this difficult this early on. But I haven't been able to find such good equipment for myself. Yeah, I didn't pick up anything in town or anything like that. And, uh... And this is pretty much the hardest part right here. Okay, uh... Need to rearrange this a bit. What do I have in here? Alright. Uh, this is a green cap. That means it's part of a set. You might as well identify it. Uh, these are usually not that great. This one, however, is pretty damn good compared to what I had. So we're gonna we're, we're gonna wear that for now. Like I said, they're usually not that great. Uh, the sets are what they say they've expanded the. Oh my god, the the stash for are for those sets. Uh, I don't buy it because I I have never once found all of the sets. Uh, I believe you have to trade to get all of them. You're not going to find them there all yourself. Oh my god, Cold Crow, die. I hate you. I hate you more than anything else because you come so damn early in the game. I'm not going to have resistance to cold this early in the game. Ah, the worst thing about it too. The worst thing about cold. We haven't even gotten to it yet. I mean, not only does it slow you down, not only am I getting constantly interrupted, not only do I fucking miss all the time... <sighs> but... Then they run. Alright. Might as well take these on. I mean, they're here. <sighs> Fine. I have to go get more potions. I have to go. Shoot that. 